We knew it was a very important game, especially we dropped the NBC game on the road last week. And we have a, a, the tougher part of our schedule coming up, so we wanted to finish, finish this part of the schedule out strong. And uh, we had a good week of practice, and I think that showed. We started out a little bit sloppy, too many turnovers, and that's how they hung around in the first half. But I think we, we held it together a lot better in the second half, and we finished it out strong. Our biggest focus was just some rebounds and some stops. We knew, you know, they're a team right now with a lot of change, a lot of new players, new coach. So we knew if we, you know, made some stops and turned up the pressure, you know, we could we could open it up a little bit. Der Schlüssel war am Ende die Verteidigung. Also wir haben nicht aufgehört äh, zu verteidigen und ähm, dazu sind natürlich noch Schüsse gefallen bei uns, was natürlich hilft. Ähm, aber durch die Verteidigung hatten wir Fast Breaks und auch einfache Punkte und ähm, irgendwann konnte Bremerhaven dann nicht mehr standhalten. We started to to get stops and we took care of the basketball. In the first half we, we got some stops and made some turnovers, but in the second half when we got those stops we we really took advantage of them and, and turned those into into points. And we shot the ball extremely well in the second half and had great ball movement. Drew's an awesome point guard. I love playing with him and I think for me what the thing that surprised me about Drew is that he's he has a good mixture of being in attack mode and same looking for his teammates. Some guys are only scoring point guards and some guys are great at distributing the ball, but they hurt the team because the other team knows they're not going to score. But with Drew, you, you really got to pick your poison because he can do both very well. I mean, it was a great team effort. I mean, Nico comes off the bench in the third quarter and, I mean, scores 10 points, really puts the game out of reach. And you, you got Tim who carried us in the beginning of the of the third quarter as well, as, long, as well as Trent. I mean, you can choose, you can choose anybody, but you wouldn't be wrong with any of those choices. I can bei jedem Spieler irgendwas sagen, was er, was er super gemacht hat. Also es ist, sei es, ob Drew die 10 Assists hat oder also bei jedem Spieler könnte man irgendwas sagen, auch Mo, der von der Bank kommt oder jeder hat so seinen Teil dazu geleistet. Von daher ist es bei uns eine, eine Teamleistung. Deswegen sind wir auch so schwer auszurechnen. And we don't measure our wins based on the opponent. Uh, it's just good for us to win whoever we play. Um, whoever we get to win against is still only worth a certain amount of points. So um, our job is to, you know, each opponent we face, uh, take care of this game, take care of this opponent to try to win. And, and that's what our focus is. This week I had tore a ligament in my thumb. Um, it's nothing that I need surgery or anything, but it's, you know, it's pretty bruised and black and blue and it was really swollen. So yesterday was my first day of practice after a few days off and uh, it felt good today. Physio did a good job getting me ready. Es gibt ein paar, die angeschlagen sind, natürlich, die, ähm, was man jetzt auch gesehen hat, äh, Kyle hatte einen kleinen äh, Verband am, am Daumen und solche Kleinigkeiten, aber es bringt uns trotzdem nicht davon, davon ab, äh, hart zu trainieren und äh, wir sind als Gruppe unglaublich zusammen, würde ich sagen, und äh, es macht Spaß auch im Training, was man auch sieht auf dem Platz, denke ich, und äh, so äh, kommen dann auch die Siege.